ध्यान से ओपीसी सीमेंट कोच वेलकम टू द इंटरव्यू यू अबाउट टू लीव बैक टू कनाडा नाउ हाउ डू यू सम अप दिस ब्रीफ ट्रिप ऑफ योर्स मी to see coming back to Kathmandu and see that the same you know set up uh, where i left um, and then came to Kathmandu and, and we we went to Bhairava uh, for a camp uh, and uh, it re- went really well i saw a lot of new talent um, and able to work with some of these uh, current national players uh, who are in the Bhairava graduates um, and we were ready but uh, uh, disappointed to see that uh, the tournament was not happening what was the feeling when you were about to land in kathmandu i mean it's a uh, like i like i always have a great feeling for nepal and uh, the four four and a half years i i you know, was here um i got so close to the culture and and the environment and uh, it was a great feeling uh, to be back i i never thought that i, I will come back uh, to nepal for a long time uh, but uh, yeah it's it's great feeling to be back in kathmandu uh you were one of the reasons uh, why nepali cricket uh, launched to the global arena and we gradually uh, made ourselves as an odi nation how did you feel when you found out the news that nepal now have begun an odi nation no it's uh, like you know i, I was even though I'm, i was not here for the last, last four years i was following every ball whatever the whenever the games are in live streaming live live telecast I, I, i've been following um and um, the uh, best uh, about um, is like you know the team was shaping up well at the beginning and and uh, and uh, that game that they nepal played against uh, you know uh, against canada um, uh, to qualify um, uh, it was great feeling to see nepal uh, Uh, reaching that ODI status, and then the players know how much, like you know, work we did uh, uh, to get there. Like you know, we were we were dreaming about getting ODI status for a long period, and and actually, I was also was pushing players, like you know, playing the lower division is not the, you know, that cannot be there. The, we are a better team. We had to be in, in, in that ODI structure, and uh, and players knows how hard, like you know, we fought to get up there. And, i'm sure that like you know all the senior players and and who was with me and the younger players they must have enjoyed that moment a big time and i was very happy uh, and then now nepal has two and a half years to put the things on the right direction uh, what do you think in presence of a cricket governing body is the right thing to do for nepal to make sure that this uh, odi status is maintained during this period of time i, I think it's a do or die like you know you, you all the seven teams who are in the, that odi league uh, like you know you you have to be in that top 3 nepal has to work so hard to get there back you know to be in that top 3 if you are in the bottom 4 you know you have to have another qualifier to you know come back and in one tournament anything can happen and 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 the new icc structure is in such a way that when once you go down it's not easy to come back and and best examples are canada like you know and hong kong uh uganda uh kenya like they 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 have only one tour per year now and and then then you have to come back to that uh, uh the, the the qualifier and you have to get into the top four so and the other country these seven countries are playing a tournament in every three months so and you have to complete compete with that like you know the those teams so the teams teams down is not in it is it's it's tough for them and and then team going from here down like uh, if they in that in that one tournament if they don't do well they are out for two and a half years so uh, i think nepal cricket is in, in, in cross road like they need to get things in the right direction now and and uh, especially when you have a circle 
you can't have changes and too many you know things going on in the middle of that circle you need to fix everything now so that the, the whole circle circle will go smoothly until the next uh, uh, next world cup in 2023 under you uh, nepal actually became a decent 2020 nation as we qualified for the 2020 world cup right but uh, to see nepal qualify uh, qualify uh, themselves to the world cup qualifiers and ultimately gain the odi status was that a bit of surprise um, uh, like you know i mean when i joined in 2011 uh, nepal was struggling in t20s and and we did a lot of work behind i cannot get up there uh, and i thought like you know we were very competitive team in among the associate as a t20 in the 2013 14 15 time period and of course we didn't do well in the 2015 uh, qualifier in ireland and and that happens to any team because it, the condition matters a lot and uh, scotland has never done well in in uh, in dubai uh, and likewise nepal has never done well in english condition so um, it was challenging for them and I, i don't say anything like you know i mean we had a tough tour in in that last qualifier in in in, in the ireland but um, but no no reason nepal to go down in the t20 version even at at, at, at this point because there's so much of talent and so, so much of t20 cricket players in the country domestically um, and i i i for me it's hard to say why uh, nepal is not performing but i think still nepal is not in a bad position because we nepal has a direct qualification to the global qualifier and and from there to you know qualify into the world cup still is on uh, but i i i, I uh, if you ask me in nepal is still, still a good team it just that for some reason they not they, the performance have gone down on the you you uh, we climbed the mountain by qualifying for the world uh, 2020 and then we hit the rock bottom when we failed in the 2015 qualifiers in uh, ireland and scotland and now we are we have hit another rock bottom by not qualifying even into the from the eastern regional 2020 qualification uh, why do you think a team like nepal struggles and cannot maintain that kind of consistency that once it shows dance opc cement um it's a, it's a, it's a bigger picture where the, the icc qualification player qualification rules change in the last uh, 12 to 18 months time and uh, so now the new rule is in 3 years time if you live in a country you are qualified to play for that country and most of these countries like this is scotland uae usa like all these countries like they uh, there are a lot of immigrants coming there and playing cricket and especially the past first class players from around the world and 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 teams like uh, uh, nepal and you know png or namibia like you know they most of them like most of the players are home grown and nepal is 100% home grown so but that's, that's not excuse but uh, but i'm trying to say is like uh, so these teams are like all the teams that who is getting uh, immigrants they are going to get better every every year so nepal has talent there's no, there's no, nepal shouldn't be worried about it they have enough talent but grooming them to 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 beat like you know these first class cricketers is is already uh, 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 top cricketers we have to have programs in, in place to compete against them uh, and whether is there or not i, I don't know uh, but talent is there you went uh, to another talent hunt when you were here uh, this time um, what did you find to be precise there, there is so much of talent and in that talent hunt we had uh, about 60 players came in youngsters and and um, so there are some great bowlers and and if i had to select five left arm spinners from that group there was about eight left arm spinners and and five of them can play any of the associate nations they are that good um, but um, uh, i was uh, so surprised and and the, the talent that i saw and we actually picked three players and and, uh, and we thought that uh, they are good enough even to come directly into the, the gladiators team 
uh, we were waiting to give that surprise, but uh, the tournament is not on. But you will see some good players coming into the gladiators team from local, locally uh, talent youngsters. Due to some unavoidable circumstances, the EPL has now been postponed. Um, isn't that a bit of a shaky thing for you? You might, uh, you would have loved to be here uh, for a uh, long time, but the tournament is postponed. Now your excitement is a bit pushed back. How does it feel? Yeah, like you know, I mean, uh, we had a lot of plans uh, for this whole month, uh, so now it's 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 cancelled, and we, I'm, I'm heading back in a couple of days. Um, I think those things we can we are not in control. Um, and when when next uh, EPL happens, I'm not sure. It all depends on my availability, so I don't know whether I'm going to come back or not. Uh, yeah, but I, I enjoy the time that I'm here and and uh, very thankful for the Bayro uh, Gladiators and to, to give uh, I, to get this opportunity from them. And uh, I'm I'm sure they uh, they're going to be happy how. This, like you know, how, how, like you know, these youngsters, especially the talent, talent search, and, and some of the things that we did in Bairava, uh, whether I'm there or not, like you know, it's going to be, uh, get benefited to that that team. You might not have been to many places and uh, not gone through uh, some of the systems that are available here in Nepal. But uh, have you seen any kind of changes in the cricketing culture in terms of thought process and how? Uh, uh, the players are mentally set up? Uh, I think one good thing happened to Nepal was like uh, the Sandeep's uh, uh, pathway to the you know, top uh, and, and all these youngsters are following um, uh, Sandeep, like wants to follow Sandeep's uh, pathway um, and, uh, and we were joking around in, in, in Bairava like there's so many young leg spinners, everybody wants to play ball leg spin now maybe because of Sandeep, so he has made a big impact uh, to the youngsters. Uh, but I think like, you know, looking overall, uh, there was one tournament was happening by we were in Bhairava and, and, and so much of cricket is happening. So it's, it's been picked up, it's not be like before I, when I was here, like there was some tournaments were happening, but I, I can see that those two tournaments are organized tournaments now. It's just not just a match, it's an organized tournament. So, Cricket is rolling. Cricket is happening, you know, and the players are working hard. Uh, and 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 uh, in Bairwa ground, uh, we were training on one side, and and every evening I see people, you know, the players comes and they get throw downs. They're doing spot bowling, and nobody knows them. And nobody knows where they are playing. But you can see that culture has changed, and and and, and youngsters like you know want to play hard cricket. So very nice to see that. Uh it, this might be a tricky question for you. Uh, how would you like love to be the coach of the Nepali national team once again? Um, I, I haven't thought about anything of that. I, I, I came here uh, to, to support the EPL and and, uh, and coach uh, uh, the Italian team. Um, at the moment, I'm open. I'm, I have, I'm, I, I'm not handling any of any other countries. Um, uh, uh, like you know, if, uh, if someone wants, I can think about it. But uh, I haven't really, you know, gone that deep. Uh, uh, my focus was on EPL this time. Uh, don't you think it, it's going to be the life is going to get a bit tougher if you get the same kind of people in the cricket governing body? Uh, no, I mean like you know, um, uh, the, the places that I worked. Um, uh, I always, you know, I had tough times, uh, but uh, even for someone to offer, I mean, I'm not going to be uh, going around the bush. I'm, I'm open, open to tell the, you know, straightforward. Uh, like, you know, even in the USA job that I had, I, I didn't have any problems with any anyone. But I, I was straightforward that if, if the if the environment is there for me to perform, I'm, I, I will do it. If the environment is not there to, for me to perform. Like no, no, there's no use for me. So from places like that, I I left, uh, and, and it's not against anyone. It's not it's not about any individual or anything. Um, so uh, some sometimes you know when we, when I was in Nepal, um, some some people were accusing me that I'm asking for a big 
pay and all this stuff. Yes, it's you know you need to get a pay as a coach, but at the same time it's not about money. Like you know, I will not stay in a place where I cannot perform. Uh, and when I see that, I I I have left you know in other places as well. So. Uh, I, I don't have a hard feelings with anyone. I mean, in, in, not in USA, not in Nepal. Nepal is a country that I always like. You know, my heart is there, and it's not. I, I like a lot of, you know, people, people approach and and the environment. So uh, there's no hard feelings for me. But uh, but when I when it comes to work, I'm professional. I I, I want to get results. Uh, there are few people, uh, not only few people, a lot of people, a lot of fans who want Pubudu to be back at the helm one more time. Uh, it's 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 completely a different thing because all depends on you and even the camp. But how does it feel when you are so much demanded by the fans of the country? I like, you know, I'm very appreciate like, you know, they, uh, their uh, views or their, what, they, what they have been telling in the, in the social media and, and other places. Uh, I'm very thankful for them to ha have faith on me, um, and of course, like you know, the the players that I met, in, in, you know, here with the national national players, uh, uh, my friendship and whatever, like you know, the relationship that I, I, I had with before, uh, it was like you know always very strong, and and uh, we are we you know we had different connection, so uh, that's why the Nepal is is special for me, uh, but. The, but the decision for me to, you know, be the coach or not coach, it's, I think it's not my decision or fans' decision, uh, the players' decision. So you see, the organization. So uh, up to them. Dancing, OPC Cement.